Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome to a brand new game. This is Astroneer, just came out on Steam Early Access, and it's kind of a mix between like Terra Tech and No Man's Sky. It's got some exploration, it's got some building, it's kind of a survival game. It's it's very interesting, and I've been playing a little bit and really enjoying it, so I figured we'd give it kind of a try. So basically, in this game, you play as like an astronaut, or an explorer, or an astroneer, hence the name, and you land on an alien planet, and then you kind of gather resources and build up your base and do all sorts of cool stuff. So, I don't know, it's kind of an interesting, fun game, low polygon count, kind of has this sort of vibe to it, uh, just of like, simplicity and beauty, I like it a lot. Um, so, we're gonna kind of get started here, and what we need to do is we gotta find ourselves some resources. Uh, let's see. Also, this is obviously a game, uh, in, this is a pre-alpha build that I'm building right now, uh, or that I'm playing at the moment. So there may be bugs, there may be glitches, everything you see here is of course subject to change, and all that kind of good stuff. Let's get some of this compound here. This is gonna be very useful. And we're gonna use this to build stuff. Now, we've basically got like a backpack, right? And this backpack is kind of like our inventory, and we can build a few things. So let's build a solar uh, panel for our backpack. That'll help us recharge energy faster. And let's just get back over here to kind of, you, you can see this line. This is like our tether, uh, and this restores our oxygen and our energy. And eventually, we'll get upgrades to be able to have that reach farther and uh, all that kind of good stuff. So... Uh, let's just get a bunch of this compound. And we're going to use this for a bunch of different stuff. And we can shape the terrain. We can also uh, put terrain back, like if we want to uh, do that kind of stuff. So there's uh, there's a little bit of like terraforming and stuff in it. Not a, uh, not a huge amount. And I will say that the building aspect of this game is not like... It's certainly not like... Uh, like Minecraft or anything like that, where you have like a super detailed uh, building thing, at least not that I've found so far, but there's definitely some base building and stuff that'll be going on. So let's see here. We've got one solar. Let's make one more solar using this compound. And then let's make some tethers. And these will basically kind of let us expand out in a different direction uh, or in, in other directions. And we can take these compounds and kind of put the... Oop, wrong button. Uh, there we go. So, uh, for example, if I want to go out... I'm kind of looking around for resources here. But I need to find... Uh, there's something interesting over there. So, uh, if we put T, we can place tethers. And you can see they kind of... Oop. They kind of go off in this direction. And then you can see our, our little tether line kind of expands uh, with us. So we can go farther and farther away from the ship without having to worry about running back all the time for oxygen and, and all that kind of stuff. So we can come over here and... What is this? Is this all just compound? I think this is all... Yeah, that's just tons of compound. All the compound. <laughs> and you can see we're able to... Uh, harvest stuff for a lot longer because we've got uh, this tether here tying us to the ship. Did we get uh, did we get it all? Maybe we did. Maybe we already got it. Okay, cool. So we've got a fair amount of that. We could build more tethers. What I really need to find a beacon. I don't know what the beacon does. Uh, what I need to find is another resource so we can kind of expand our base a little bit. Uh, maybe over... Nope, that's more compound. What's that? Over there, that's some sort of resource. What's this stuff? Anything good? I don't think so. I don't think that's a resource at all. That's oxygen over here. This will actually be something we'll probably want to get soon. And then we've got organics, which are these, like, flowers. 
I'm really not seeing the thing that I actually need, though. Uh, anyway, so one thing we can do here is we can take some of this stuff and just kind of, like, store it on our thing. I don't think I can put that there. No, I can't. Okay. But we can just kind of store some of the things here. And then if I can get myself some resin... Uh, I'll be able to kind of expand my base a little bit. And that actually might be resin right over there. I think I see some off in the distance. Let's kind of go off this way. And I think... Yeah, and I'm almost out of tether, but that's okay. Yeah, here we go. This is resin. And we can use this to expand our base and uh, build some new like, machines and all sorts of different cool stuff. So, uh, let's get that. Can I make... Yeah, I do have some more. So let's make another thing of tethers. There we go. And then... We can kind of put those over here to get us closer to the resin. Let's just plop this guy down, like, right there. That should work. And then we'll just try and gather up all this good stuff. There we go. Oh, there's more. There's so much. It's, like, everywhere. Uh, and at night, I think your power, like, regenerates so, uh, slow, more slowly. Like, I'm tethered to the thing, which is helpful. But, oh, and there's a cave down here. Awesome. Oh, that's super good. That means we're going to find all sorts of good resources down in there. Let's just clear a little bit of a path. And let's head back and expand our base using some of that uh, uh, resin that we just found. And I, oh, I can run. I can hold shift to run. I just learned that. Awesome. Okay, so if we come over here and we take some of this we can kind of expand that out a little bit. And then we can go in here and plop some of that down. And then it gives us a few different options of things we can build. So we've got kind of this big platform. We can make a smelter, we can make a vehicle bay, a printer, and a research thing. And all of those are going to be needed. Research looks like it just needs compound. Um, and I've got, there's compound, like, all over the place, so maybe we'll do that, so we can research some things. Let's just kind of get all of this. There we go. That should be good. Let's start with the research station. I mean, I don't actually have anything to research at the moment, but I will. I'll find things as we go. So we have go like that. And then we've got ourselves a research station, which is pretty cool. There we go. Now, uh, let's go get some more of the, um, I forget, I keep forgetting the names of the resources. Let's head off this way. See if we can get ourselves, uh, that was not the way that I wanted to go. Where was that big cave? Was that off? in this direction? Yeah, that was off in this direction. Um, I think, right? Am I lost? <laughs> no way I'm lost already. Or did I have a tether that didn't, like, connect properly? Yeah, looks like these ones are not connected properly. Okay, let's just put another one down right there. There we go. That's better. So if we head off this way, is there another cave down here? Oh, there totally is. All right, let's, let's grab another tether and let's tether ourselves down. Oh, 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 oh. Apparently falling in damage is a thing. <laughs> well, all right. Um, <laughs> So, first death, that didn't take very long. Um, I don't know what happened there. I just kind of, like, 
kept sliding around and falling. Let's get some more compounds so I can make some more tethers so we can go explore that properly. There we go. That should be enough. Make some tethers. And there we go. Okay. Now, let's try this again. This time, let's try not to fall to our death. So, I'm just going to kind of go around a little bit. And we'll put this right here. And then, hmm. Maybe we kind of hollow out a little bit of a pathway. I think that's probably a good idea. Yeah, there we go. Can I get a tether down here? If I put that right there? Yeah, there we go. What is this? Power. Okay. We've got more compound over here. This is energy up here. Hydrazine. I think that's a fuel. Well, actually, it says it's a fuel, so I guess that kind of solves that mystery for us. Drop another tether. Oh, this is a big cave. This is a really big cave. Um, let's get some of the power. That'll probably come in handy. And, oh, it looks like there's even more stuff down here. How far down does that... That looks like a good way to fall to my death. Let's, uh, let's not do that. Come on. Go down. And I don't think this is anything. Yeah, that's nothing. Okay, so we've got power... What I really need to find is some source of, like, copper. This might work. What's over here? Anything? Not really. Hmm. Just trying to clear some sort of pathway. There we go. And looks like I'm out of tethers, so let's make some more of those. And then the interesting thing is if I have this power, my suit will actually use it, uh, which is pretty cool. So it'll help me stay around longer. And as long as I keep tethering myself, I shouldn't run out of oxygen either, which is also good. And there's some oxygen right there. Oh, there we go. I think that's what we need over there. Oh, that one didn't move far enough. Let's put it here. There we go. This stuff. What is this? Laterite. Is that copper or is that like some... I, I'm, I think that's probably like aluminum. Yeah, it's basically aluminum. Okay. So there's that. Put another tether down over here. There's copper. I see it. Way over here. And the other nice thing about the whole tether thing is that you'll never get lost. <laughs> because you can just follow your tethers back to your base. Which is super useful. There we go. And are we full? We're almost full. There's some more. Get it. Come on, can we not? Maybe we can't collect it because we're empty, or? Hmm. No? Oh, there we go. Got it. All right, let's put that over here. And I'm out again. I'm out of tethers yet again, but there we go. I've got a little bit more of this compound. So let's put that up here. What is this? Oh, I think that's actually... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's resin. We need that. Let's get a decent amount of this. There we go. Oh, why am I not tethered at the moment? There we go. 
It's a little, the, the tethers are a little funky. Sometimes they don't work the way you think they would. But we've got a whole bunch of resources now that I want to take back to my base. Um, let's see. Let's go this way. And we'll come back here and explore more later. But let's take this back and see if we can expand our base a little bit. We've got that research station. Uh, I'd like to get a smelter so I can get more... Uh, ooh, and actually, I want to get more energy. Because we're actually going to need that for our smelter. That should be adequate. There we go. I think we'll be good now. And now we just need to work our way back. All right. I'm going to head... Not that way. I'm going to head this way. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to head back to the base. Okay, so now that we're back, we should be able to expand this again. And I think we'll go in this direction this time. So let's kind of bring that out. And then, oh, I've only got one resin. I need a little bit more. Hmm. Okay. Well, in the meantime... We can store some of this stuff on these little snap spots just to kind of let it hold on to that. Oh, is it? Oh, it's, oh, it's powering itself. Oh. So actually, I see. Interesting. All right, can we, let's put that down. Okay, so I need more of the resin, then, is what it looks like. More resin, and then probably some more compound as well. Uh, although I've actually got some compound right there. So I think resin is going to be the big thing that I really need right now. Because we want to expand the base, get a lot of the different things unlocked. Um, and there was a bunch of resin here. Yeah, looks like there's more. Good, good, good. Let's just kind of clear some of this stuff away. And that looks like more resin down there. Can I... Nope, I will fall to my death if I go that way. Can I, like, hollow out a little bit of a pathway? Oh, and can what if I, like, bring some of this up... Yeah, there we go. Made ourselves a little path. That seemed to work. Yeah, that totally worked. Awesome. So, is this hydrazine or is this... Nah, that's hydrazine. That's not what we need. What is this? There are, like, so many things in this game to explore and, like, check out. Unknown. Oh, this is the unknown thing. Oh, so I can take this back. I think I need to carry it like this, though. I can't just, like, throw it in my pack or something. So let me run this thing back and let's try and research it and see how that works. All right, so we can put that in here and then hit this button. And I think, yeah, and then it does research, but we're out of power. Oh, okay, I see. So, and then, so now we have the trade platform researched. Gotcha. Okay, so it looks like if it's at full power... It's going to use, like, the whole, the, the entirety of that power to research one item. Okay, that makes sense. Oh, and I've actually got enough uh, resin now to put that there. And then we can expand this. And what I want is a smelter. And I need compound for that. Okay, that's easy compound we have uh let's put it on no i want i want to put it on the other one 
oh, whatever. It's fine. Let's grab that, put that here. Make me a smelter. And then we can smelt these ores like malachite and stuff into copper, which we can then use to actually like build stuff. So that should be good. Uh, it does need power though. So let's see, and let me run off and see if I can find myself a little bit of power. I know we've got some. We found a whole bunch of it. In fact, I think there was a fair... Yeah, there's a bunch of it right here. Let's just get this. There we go. And let's actually put a tether... Right... What? What? Why can't I tether myself to... To this? That's a little funky. <laughs> There we go. Let's see, and this is all one big tether. Okay, so I've got a little bit of power. I'm gonna need some more than that, though. This isn't gonna be enough. Looks like there's a little bit right there. Okay, we've got two. Oh, and there's some more down here. Okay, awesome. Uh, I do not, however, have any more tethers. So... Is there any more compound around here that I can make more tethers with? I don't see any. Yeah. Ah, man. Hmm. Here we go. We can use this. We'll use that to get ourselves some more. Oh, tell me that's not all of it. <laughs> I think... Oh, no, there's a little bit more right here. There we go. All right, let's make some more tethers. Oh, no. Tethers. There we go. All right. So now, if we plop that guy down over here, should be able to gather all of that up. And now we've got some power so that we can head back and get the smelter. Awesome. Okay, so we're here. So if I grab that and I put that here, this thing should charge up. And then let's put another one on there and let's just hit smelt. And see. Okay, so there we go. Now we have copper and aluminum. Awesome. So let's see. Generator uses copper. So let's make a generator. And then we can put that right here. And then it needs uh, uh, bio, basically biofuel. But let's make another one of those. Oh, that's aluminum. I thought I had more copper than that. Ah, there we go. Alright, let's make another one of those. And we'll use that one for our resource station. There we go. And then let's just put a power thing here and there. And it looks like that'll power essentially everything until that's all gone. And then I've got this oxygen, which will, this uh, this blue bar up here is my oxygen. And I have, obviously we don't want that to run out, but it looks like that'll work. And then we can gather all of these. I'm assuming this will give me, yeah, organics. This is like orange grass over here. Let's go there. And here, and we can just gather all of this stuff. Get our, get our organics on. Yeah, there we go. There's a lot of greenery over here. Okay, so now we've got some organics. And I'm assuming I can take you and put that there. 
And then we can do the same thing right there. There we go. And I don't know if I necessarily need another generator. So for now, let's just put that right here. We'll put our oxygen away. Tethers I do want to keep. Aluminum. Uh, can I make anything with aluminum? I can make a wind vane. I'm assuming that's some sort of like generator. So if I put that on here, will that like very slowly passively generate power? Or does it require power to work? I think it's generating power slowly or something. I'm not really sure. I don't really know what that does. If you know, please tell me. I'd be interested to find out. Uh, but anyway, that's kind of uh, Astroneer. I, I don't want to make this episode too long, but that's kind of the idea of it. Uh, when we've only scratched the surface, there's a lot more left to do. Uh, there's vehicles, there's all sorts of research, there's tons of exploration, and a lot more things that we can build and uh, expand our base with and all that kind of cool stuff. So there you go. But guys, unfortunately, I am out of time for this episode, so my friends, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.